Hello everyone, Donnell HD here, and today I'm going to show you how to set up, configure, and install the Microsoft MSX and MSX2 emulator Blue MSX on LaunchBox. As per usual, I have my arcade folder here, and inside that folder, I have my emulators folder, my LaunchBox folder, and the ROMs folder where we're going to be keeping our ROMs. I left two Dropbox links in the description below for the two emulators we're using. All you have to do is click here on download. All right, I've downloaded the MSX1 and MSX2 necessities files and placed them here on my desktop. What I'm going to do now is extract the contents of those files into the emulators folder. Now, as you can see, when I go into the emulators folder, I have two emulators here. Okay, I'm going to go to each emulator and I'm going to configure it. I'm just showing you both of my processes here at the same time. So go into your folder and click on the blue MSX icon here. When you first load it up, you're gonna see this screen. The first thing you're gonna do is gonna to go to Options, click on Performance. In the full resolution category here, make sure that the resolution matches your resolution on your computer. Now I'm gonna to go to Tools, Input Editor. I'm using a two button joystick that I selected from dropping this down arrow in the configuration and selecting two button joystick. Right now it's already pre-configured for Xbox controllers, so if you need to configure, you can simply click on the direction that you want to use, for example B here, and then it will show what it is. Just press the corresponding key on your device and it will change. I'm going to click OK here, and now I'm going to click File, Exit. Now it's time to set these emulators up in LaunchBox. Okay, now that we're here in LaunchBox, I'm going to go up here to the top left corner. I'm going to go to Tools, Manage, Emulators. I'm going to click Add. Under Emulator Name, I'm going to name it Blue MSX with the MSX1 in parentheses so I know which emulator it is. And I'm naming this emulator Blue MSX with the MSX2 in parentheses. Now I'm going to set the path. Once again, it's on my desktop. Arcade, Emulators, Blue MSX, MSX1 here and the blue MSX icon here. And this side I'm going to browse to desktop, arcade, emulators, blue MSX, MSX2 folder, and the blue MSX icon here. Now I'm gonna go to associated platforms and I'm gonna name the associated platform Microsoft MSX. And on this side I'm gonna name the platform Microsoft MSX2. And I'm going to click here to check it as my default emulator. Now I'm going to go to the running script area. And I left the script in the description below that will allow the emulator to switch to full screen three seconds after loading the game and be able to escape out of the emulator easily by pressing the escape key. I'm going to paste that here. And then I'm going to click OK. And then close. Now it's time to import our games. Okay, now I'm gonna go down here to my ROMs files and go inside my ROMs folder. And as you can see, I have two MSX files here. I'm gonna grab each folder and I'm gonna independently drop them in the launch box like so. What type of game files are you importing? Click ROM files. What platform are you importing games for? Make sure you click Microsoft MSX and MSX2 on the right. Next, manually configure emulator. What emulator would you like to use? Make sure you have the appropriate emulator for the ROMs that you dropped in. Next, use the files in their current location. Next, 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 next. Make sure your games are spelled correctly and then click finish. And now you have successfully set up and installed both MSX emulators on LaunchBox. Thank you everyone for watching. If this video helped out at all, support the channel and drop a like and subscribe. I've created many tutorials for other platforms as well. Just follow the thumbnails on the screen. As always, I'm Don LHD and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.